G'day everyone, Crystal Fisher here. I'm here with another episode of Crystal Fisher's Kitchen. It has been a bloody long time, but today I've got it, I've got it all ready. We are cooking, what does this look like? Golden crumpets, cup of tea, and oh shit, looks like right. Crumpet and hearty Australian bushels tea. Hell yes. All right, so the first thing we wanna do, we wanna get this water, we wanna get this cup, fill it up with a shite load of water. Here we go. Now I've already got a bit of water in there I reckon, so hopefully it will heat up. Fill that up, just like that, there we go. Plenty of water, you can feel that in this, see the, there we go. You see me filming there. Press on, the cup, there you go. Then. Next, you get your crumpets. See, I've got these, of course. What's your skills? Australian style. One crumpet, as they sit in Britain. So, get the crumpet, of course. Put it down there. Get out the mofo toaster. Like that. We have seen this toaster before, haven't we, uh, dudes? Get the toaster out. Pop. Done. Now, while we're waiting for that, we get a cup of tea ready. So, what you do, of course, now you get the tea bag. And you go get this spoon, which has been carrying this $20 note. Okay. Okay, so what you want to do is you want it now. This is to have a healthy, you know, Australian healthy cup of tea. We are not like... Uh, our rival network show, Nintendo Gen 64's Kitchen, where he actually says he uses two spoons of teaspoon. Two spoons of teaspoon. Two spoons of teaspoon. Uh, of uh, sugar. No, that's not what you do, mate, okay? Now, when I meet you in Sydney, I'm gonna have to word you about that because I'm telling you now, one sugar is a perfect amount. You get the water, but maybe we might just heat that up again. While you wait for this to go. Oh, I might as well get the cup out. Should be more organized, but you know, this is typically uh, Fish's Kitchen is not, not the most organized place on the planet, okay? So it's done like that. Get your water, tip that in, and that is some fucking hot and steamy. Just like the boarding house. Uh -huh. All right, there we go. Fill that with water. Absolutely fucking brilliant. Then what you do, you dunk. You just dunk, dunk, dunk. Dunk, dunk. Okay, that's how you do it. It's all about the dunking. You need to make sure you get a perfect consistency in there. Can you see that? It's dark, but it could be a bit more. You know, you, you try and move it around a bit, kind of just get that sort of texture, that sweet texture just to sort of go in, you know what I mean? Then we go to our favorite fridge, our favorite fridge. I was panicking for a second, I actually thought there was no milk, and I tell you, if there was no milk, you guys would not be happening by now. There would not be a happy camper, even though we are not camping. Now, pour the milk in like that with one hand, because we're quite intelligently skilled, and then you can continue to dunk to get a bit more of a consistency there. Um, this is just my own uh, Fisher method. If you don't do this, the end of the world will not arrive, but, um, you know, I think that you should follow my uh, instructions in the cup of tea. Mix like that. Oh, just on time. That has gone up. So you got your cup of tea there. And then you get your crumpet. There we go. That's how you do it. There we go. Now we need to get our delicious butter, which should be in the fridge. Not from Tajay. Where is the butter? Butter, butter. I can't believe it is not butter. All right, here we go. Here's the butter. Typical, crappy, well, actually mediocre Australian butter. I prefer Flora, to be perfectly honest. But um, you know, if Mum doesn't want to buy that this week, then that is just a real fucking shame. So, then what you do? Get the butter out. That. It has already started to melt. I don't know why. It must be a really hot day here in Australia, mate. Put it on. Look at that. It's melting like 
like butter. Get it? Because it is butter. <laughs> yes, yes, that was really funny. All right, um, there we go. Delish, delish. There we go. Now we can also do. If you want to get, you can get fucking. You can get Vegemite if you want. You can get, you know. Vegemite. Now, where the hell is the Vegemite? Where the hell is the Vegemite? Vegemite. Yeah! Where is the Vegemite? You've got to be fucking joking me! Wait. That's the second time? No Vegemite. That's alright, because you know what? This looks like a pretty darn good meal. I think this is a very nice snack for the breakfast, even though it is about uh, 2.33 at the hour. I hope you enjoyed that. I hope you enjoyed this meal. This is going to taste very nice. You just look at that. It's got that golden, crunchy feeling to it, which you, you want, you know? I mean, Jamie Oliver would be jealous of this. Um, and then, you know, your cup of tea. But you can see that consistency and that color. Absolutely marvelous. I don't have to spill everywhere. Throw that in there. That's it. Now you clean up. There we go. I hope you enjoyed that episode of Crystal Fish's Kitchen. Once again, episode 10 coming up next. Don't know what the hell I'm going to do for that, but uh, hopefully it'll be something uh, pretty freaking epic. Okay? So, goodbye everyone, and remember... Nothing.